मार्च फिफ्टीन मर्डर ऑफ संदीप सिंह संधू मे नाइन्थ रॉकेट अटैक एट मोहाली पंजाब पुलिस इंटेलिजेंस हेडक्वार्टर्स एंड मे ट्वेंटी नाइन द मर्डर ऑफ द फेमस सिंगर एंड पॉलिटिशियन सिद्धू मूसेवाला दिस थ्री इंसिडेंट इन पंजाब टेल अ स्टोरी इट इज अ स्टोरी ऑफ क्राइम गैंगस्टर्स एंड देयर रिवेंज Punjab police say that the attack on Sidhu Musewala was made by Goldie Barar, a Canadian gangster, and Lawrence Bishnoi, who is also in Goldie's gang. Local authorities also say that Musewala's death was caused by a result of a gang war. Now, this raises two very important questions. Number one, who are these gangs that are operating out of Punjab and at times out of Canada? And number two, which are the other gangs that the police need to look out for? Soon after the murder, a Facebook post appeared in which Bishnoi's friend Goldie Barar. who lives in Canada took the responsibility of the murder the post said that it was an act of revenge against Musiwala for what they said he did to cause the deaths of two men youth leader Vicky Midukhera last year and Bishnoi aide Gurlal Barar in 2020 Goldie allegedly employs hit squads in India to carry out these assassinations but where is Bishnoi he is currently lodged in Tihar jail where he is being interrogated two more prisoners from Firozpur and Bhatinda jail are also being questioned but this does not stop here for murdering sandeep singh sandhu the police have named snowball dillon who is also based in canada police said that out of the three accused two are based in canada and one of them is in malaysia this points to massive influence of gangsters who are operating in canada but are working in india but there are more active gangs as well many of these gangs are active in ontario british columbia and in alberta over the years these gangs have separated and fled arrest on their own now there are reportedly gangs like dosan johals adivals chimas butters dhaks and dures as well the presence of such gangs in canada is not new in fact the canadian connection to this criminal network is pretty old one such important case emerged in the 1990s between vancouver's bupinder johal and ranjit ron dosanj in 1994 ranjit dosanj threatened to kill bupinder by shooting him in the back He had accused him of killing his brother Jimmy Dosanjh but a few days later Ranjit himself was murdered in broad daylight at the same time there are other local gangs in Punjab as well Bambiha gang operates in Punjab's Malwa region but reportedly it is being operated by Armenia based Gaurav Patiyal there are other gangs as well that at times attack each other violently and at times release viral songs Even the songs promote gun culture and now these criminals are losing fear of the police. The police is now trying to control the situation especially after the high profile assassination of Siddu Musewala. Punjab also has anti-gangster task force to control the situation. But the biggest worry is that Punjab should not slip into the vicious cycle of violence once again. What do you think about this? Let me know in the comment section. And if you like this video, do not forget to drop in a like and subscribe to India Times.